Um, I'm trying filming in the hallway now that the light is working again, so we'll see, I guess. You're propped up against cake mixes, so we'll see how this works. Um, I'm filming another one of my thumbs, whatever, do you, I, I tell, I don't know what to call them, videos. Um, this one is on a mascara, it's the Benefit, their real mascara. Okay, yeah, I think we're going to have to... That's not even right set up. But yeah, everybody knows what this stuff looks like and is and everything. Everybody goes on about it and says how awesome it is. I've been using it for a week? Two weeks? Something like that. I think it's been about two weeks. Um, the brush looks like this. Sorry. Oh, dang it. I just got mascara all over me. Sorry, the um, lighting thing will be fixed. But it's basically a plastic spiky wand with some extra spikies on the tip. That's the gist of it. Um, it's okay. It, I've got it on now. I don't know if you can see it. Um, it looks nice. I think I've said before when I'm talking about mascaras, my eyelashes are fine on their own so when I wear mascara I want it to be like really awesome amazing like do, does great things and this does nice things it looks good um the only bad thing about it is another thing everybody talks about that's a little bit difficult to get off but I've been using this wet n wild eye makeup remover which I do plan on doing one of these videos about um and as long as I like, you know, pay attention and actually use it all over, it, it gets this stuff off. So that's not really a problem for me. Um, but yeah, I basically would give this like a thumbs meh. I mean, it's nice, but it's not so amazing that I'm going to repurchase it. I finished what I have. I have another sample of it, but it's not something I have to go out and buy. So that's my thought on it, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.